hey there, didn't see you. Caught me driving on the way to uh, paint night, which is uh, our first date that uh, my now wife and I are, uh, are going to. And uh, she will explain a little bit of background about the paint night. First off, ignore him, he's a dork. But anyway, <laughs> um, so about two, a little over two years ago, Brian and I had our first date. And it was a paint night down in King of Prussia, Pennsylvania, where Brian used to live at the time. So it was like a five minute drive for him and an hour drive for me, but it's fine. <laughs> anyway, so we um, recreate this pretty much every year now, except this year it's a little bit later because uh, the paint, painting with a twist place was closed on our anniversary date. So we decided to push it back and find a painting that we really liked. Um, so this one is going to be more like a farm scene. Um, so that's what we're going for. Um, the other ones that we've done was like a cliff scene and the, the Northern Lights. Northern Lights. So anyway, yeah, so that's why it's actually on Valentine's Day this year, but normally we go on January 11th. So we plan on recreating this and having a whole bunch of paintings to display of our very talented artwork, let me tell you. Yeah, very. T hers is a lot better than mine because <laughs> I have problems drawing stick figures. Um, <laughs> so we'll see how this one turns out. Hopefully it's better than the last two. I'm hoping that those continually to um, gain in their artistic work. Uh, we'll see how it goes. We'll see. I think you need to paint more than once a year for it to improve though, babe. <laughs> 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 yeah, but anyway, so yeah, we're excited and it's February 14th instead of January 11th, but it's a little, it's about a month late, but I'm excited for what it's going to look like. Yeah, me too. So we will take you guys along and uh, do a time lapse or speed it up, one of the two, and we will see how it goes. So um, thank you guys for looking at it and we'll hope that it turns out okay. Bye guys. Hey guys, post editing Brian here. Um, our GoPro um, had some issues uh, with corrupting footage that Issues should be fixed now uh, for, for going forward, but uh, unfortunately all of the footage from uh, Valentine's Day weekend uh, was corrupted. Uh, so we have progress pictures instead, uh, so I'm going to post those up here. And then uh, um, after the progress pictures, we have uh, all of the uh, completed paintings that we've done over the years. Um, but like I said, that issue should be resolved now. Uh, with the corruption of the camera. Uh, so going forward, we will have actual footage instead of progress pictures. I uh, hope you guys enjoy. Thanks. So this is the painting that we actually just finished up doing. Um, you can see here, Megan's on the left, mine on the right. Uh, I like Megan's sky more than mine. Megan, li Megan likes my field better than her field. Uh, so uh, same uh, same picture, but it's different different depictions and different how it came out uh, with our mixing in, 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 in our character. So these ones are actually the first one that we did on our first date. Uh, you can see there the M and down at the bottom right versus the MC. I'm a little partial to the MC, but that's just me. Uh, we had a really good fun time um, doing this on our first date. Uh, it was a really good idea to do, um, and we liked it so much that we actually went back uh, the year after for our first anniversary um, of, our, of our first date and did these. Um, we really had time and really enjoyed these again, um, and we continue uh, want to continue doing uh, paint nights throughout the years and we're just gonna hang them on the walls um, where we can and have a nice art uh, for us to hang up and uh, and show that over the years of the, our progression of art. Hey guys, um, so we're talking about what we did on Valentine's Day weekend. So you guys saw the video of 
Um, our paint night, and that was what we did on Valentine's Day, but the night before Valentine's Day, we actually went to this really fancy, very expensive <laughs> dinner. It was like not our typical scene, but it was just a lot of fun. Um, and so it was actually at our venue where we were supposed to get married, um, but we actually are planning on getting married. It's complicated in, <laughs> in June. <laughs> COVID weddings, you know. Yeah, we were supposed to get married last April ended up not happening at the venue because of everything that happened with COVID. So we pushed it back. We got married still, but we pushed it back for so our celebration is going to be next June. Anyway, so it's supposed to be there um, in Pottstown. And so it was there, sorry. We went and uh, it was amazing. And so you walked up and there was a champagne greeting, um, which was interesting because we had to wear masks. But <laughs> um, and then you stood in line and went in and it was open bar and the food was amazing and there's this band there that was just awesome and so we did a lot of dancing and it was just it was just a lot of fun it was good the band was called um the uptown band mm -hmm. um they were very good um there was never one to think um of a band to play a wedding and that's kind of their their main gig is wedding and events uh but they actually really changed my mind um if we weren't uh weren't already planned for everything, that would be in consideration for actually have a band at, at the wedding. So that was really cool to see. Um, me being the uh, music nerd that I am, really enjoyed it as well. Um, so that was really cool to see. Um, it was a uh, four course dinner as well, like Megan said, it was super fancy. Um, and you guys can, can see the pictures there. Um, this guy actually put on a tie, so like. I did, I did. <laughs> I haven't worn a tie um, in, Besides weddings? Besides the weddings uh, in a very long time. Um, so uh, it was it was a lot of fun, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we look forward to hopefully doing it again next year if they're doing it. Uh, that may be a new Valentine's Day tradition, who knows? Uh, but uh, with that, um, we'll let you guys watch the pictures that we have um, of the night. Just kind of felt really weird having a camera uh, there with live music and people. Um, so we just took a bunch of pictures, so uh, we'll let the pictures roll and uh, hope you guys enjoy the uh, full Valentine's Day extravaganza that we had. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Thank you.